We are legends in our free time. When we last left off at Pokemon Adventure number 5812, who's counting at this point, what a geek had caught up to Taurus in Veilstone City, and after a little bit of exploring, they both challenged Maylene to battle. Taurus had emerged victorious in his bout, while what a geek had to take an episode break to sulk and pout in order to ensure he had the upper fist for next time. Meanwhile, Exio has made his way southwest and arrived at Pastoria City, at which point he donned his galoshes and went wading through the Great Marsh in search of his next team member. Can Exio's luck come through for him? It most likely will. And let him a rare Pokemon in the Great Wash? Find out- <laughs> Wait, that just- Great Marsh! Silly me. Anyways, find out now. And it counts steps even if I'm just moving left and right, right, without actually walking? No. Oh, cheat codes. But Barrel, you were not that common until just now. You, now you're just the only thing I see. There are different areas that increase and decrease in spawn rates for some things. Hmm. All these big doofy Pokemon! I probably should have endeavored. I have some super potions, I'll go ahead and use those. <clears throat> ah! <clears throat> This is just the swamp of the dumbest looking Pokemon. Clefairy, you suck. So wait, what <coughs> other dumb Pokemon are in there besides Bidoof? There's Bidoof and the Quagsire and Psyduck. They just all look doofy. Quagsire is awesome. It's still doofy. <coughs> hey, 5 HP. Now don't be paralyzed. Dang it. Damn but hurt it. yourself in confusion. Damn it. Just want to endeavor you so it Monferno can finish you off. Why? Finally, hit something. I want my Skoru Pie back. Okay, last attempt at this endeavor, and then just get rid of Rockhog. How long are you going to be confused <gasps> for, dude? Come on. Goru there we go. in your female this time. Anyone expect <coughs> to get a uh, shiny in this playthrough? Nope. <coughs> yep. <coughs> this Use that potion. Hasn't... There you go. You weren't even right. going to attempt to, like, give me any hope. God dang it. Uh, that's a Meryl Meryl. Sure, one more time for good measure. <clears throat> oh, Skorupi again. That was the fastest time yet. It's female again. Get caught! Ain't shake! Uh-oh. You better watch carefully as I throw a yet another ball. Pokemon Mansion. Oh, hi, Looker. <clears throat> Go away. Quit not shaking. Uh-oh. Whoops. Mm. Might have made a critical mistake. What was your critical mistake? Uh, assuming that Monferno would be able to use Flame Wheel on <clears throat> Lucario and have it survive. Oh, yeah, no. It's fine. I have a plan. Stab fire move. Yeah. <clears throat> I am one with the marsh. I have a plan, assuming Rock Tomb hits for once. <clears throat> there we go. How's your little fishy doing? Uh, it's still level 22, so not too great. What'd you name it? S uh, Spectre. Spectre, okay. Inspector. Gadget. Do -do 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 -do. Exactly. Okay, I got fly. Of the marsh made men by the marsh, undone by the marsh.
I hate you and your do face. So wait, how far ahead are you? He's a decent chunk ahead of you right now. Am I? Yeah. I don't remember. Oh wait, yeah. I'm still on the veilstone. Oh wow, you're like an entire town behind me. And I'm still. Had a girl, Jimmy. Samsa. <clears throat> so wait, do I do anything in the galactic building now or no? No, just go into the warehouse to get fly. Yeah, I did that. And that's pretty much all you needed it for. Okay. Guess I should teach that to El Crippone. <clears throat> Drain punch? How's that spelled? What? Whatever that name is. El Crippone? Yeah. Instead of El Capone? You, you, you didn't spell the pwn with P-W-N? No. no. Oh, that would have been the best. <laughs> In an ironic sense. So, the best. The best. It would have been the best. Can I just right, get a... Now, side now where do I want to go? South. South. South? Going south. I need to go <clears throat> save Dawn's Pokedex. Are you saved her decks? I need from... to. I need to. Oh. No, I don't want to. Oh, she has goal. another Pokedex. You look like a psychic. <laughs> Turns out he's actually a PI. <clears throat> psychic Abigail has a Chingling. No, oh, no, the PI is later. Good thing I have dark type moves. <laughs> and a dark You're type so laugh. diabolical. I know, it's amazing. Score Rupee, I have to have words with you. Specifically ball. a nickname. Specifically a ball. I don't have a nickname, do I? No. I mean, look, and it would uh, catch it as soon as I was like, no. oh man, I better take some time to make You had no nicknames picked out, actually. <laughs> Sounds about You're right. Winging. Well, since my naming scheme has been ruined, and there's not really anything in Berserk that goes with Scorpion. Unless... What were you going to name your uh, Perugly, Zod? Yes. Missing don't, both horns. Don't, don't do that. That's, <laughs> that's, that would be an insult to the character. <clears throat> I don't know about that. Alright, Scorpy. What should you be, Kazka? Is it female? It is. That's an ugly Kazka. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just picturing uh, it when it's evolved with its mustache and its. No, oh, no. Ugly face. Exactly. It's no neck. It already has no neck. Uh. Just name it Rupee. Rupee? Because it's got Rupee in its name. Oh, sure. Am I going through the cave or am I going down? Uh, you're going down. Yeah, you're going down. <gasps> I thought Muddy Water behaved like it does in future generations, where it would hit your partner Pokemon as well, and Cliff Air just used it. I got a Magmarizer. I know it's a it's a female, but this name fits too well. So do it. Here we go. What is it? Let me Google how you spell it real quick. Got it. I was about to already misspell it in the second letter. Very well done. Yes. Expected nothing less. What is it? What do you think it is? That's my other name. <laughs> uh. Oh no! Will it not? Fit? Oh! Oh! It okay, won't Clefairy. What did it do? It <laughs> used dynamic punch and landed it. Oh, nice. Elker nice. Bone cannot 
hit anything if it's confused. You know what? I'll just, uh... I'll just, uh... Eh, eh, eh. I'm just gonna omit the O. Oh my god, you are a douche, Bronzor. Confuses my first thing, sleeps my second thing. Afraid to send anything else out, it might yeah, murder it. Work? It's Scaramouche. How is that fit? Because Scaramouche, scare, it's just the same. Shut up. No, that doesn't fit at all. Name it at Scaramouche. That you only have dumb. ten letters to work with. It doesn't fit at all. <laughs> I mean, letters wise. Remove the vowels. That that looks like jumbly goop. Wait a minute. I'll just completely misspell it. <laughs> Why don't you just name it Ashi then? Cause then it would it doesn't have enough of a monkey face. Her face was annoying. Finally, leech seed, huh? <clears throat> but now you're gonna have three grass type moves. Uh, it's gonna completely Ugh. misspell it just to fit it. Screw it. We don't need Mega Drain. We're just gonna use leech seed. Sure. Scaramouche. But spelt completely wrong. <gasps> Horse bite. Grattle's Horse bite evolving at 32? Yep. He evolves earlier. Wait, did I not go? Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, yeah. Meanwhile, like, Zero and I have ours evolve at 36. Oh, okay, the areas were numbered backwards. I was wrong. So it's like in Gen yeah, 1, but two. unlike in Gen 2. Yes. Gen 2, uh... 30... For Alligator evolves at 32. No, for Alligator evolves at 30. Oh, he wants to learn an Earthquake. Yes. Amazing. Uh... All right, sorry, curse, but you're going away. <clears throat> yeah, for alligator evolves at thirty, Bayleaf evolves at thirty-two, and Typho, or sorry, Quilaba evolves at thirty-six. Heal my Pokemans. What was in this cave back here? That's, what I want to see. Uh, that's where you get Hippopotas. The Ruin Mania Cave. Yep. I think you can just run around there and find Hippopotas. Like, is this the only place you get them? Yeah. Oh, I don't have... Really? That's right, I freaking got a stupid well, star. Well, I, I need him. He's part of my team. <clears throat> Let me just double check. I think you might need to catch some unknown in order to expand the... Uh, expand that cave. But I think you can just find him a Patas in there somewhere. Well, so far, I'm only finding Geodude. Do I need to cut anything anytime soon? I don't have a name picked out for him. Or yeah, you, you can well. find him there. It's a 5% spawn rate, though. And that's the only place? Yeah. Uh, if you have twenty five or 26 or more unknown, so different unknown. Unique unknown? Yeah, unique unknown. It, so I need jumps, like up the whole to, it jumps up to 20%. What do you got? But uh, you don't need to catch them. No, it's too serious. Battle armor. Oh, acupressure. That could be broken. Well, I'll I'll come back and get him after. I mean, if you take your time here, then I have some time to... Uh, well, I mean, when you guys are doing the ghost gym, I'll come here. Fair enough. That's a tiny cave for hippos to be living in. Okay. Fare thee well, Clefairy. You will not be missed. Fare thee well. Okay, should I... What gym is this again? This is the... Oh, yeah, Crash or Wake. Better not hit with Horn Drill. I'd be super salty if that was the case. Hmm... P.I. Carlos. There you go. There's the P.I. Oh, yeah, I've got Magical Leaf to get me through this gym. Hooray. Is that Cynthia I see down there? Yep, that's Cynthia. I just see her hair 
Uh, it's very <laughs> identifiable. Right. Ah, uh, Tusk got Rupee. It's so energetic. And in a minute, it's gonna be so dead. No, you Sonic Boom! I also was gonna make a Guile joke, but I could not think of anything in time. Oh no, use Aqua Jet! Ancient Power, yes! Your first rock move. Unfortunately, it's special in this game, so... Kratos won't Wait. be able to make use oh, yeah. of it. It's well. better than the other crap. That's true. Ooh, Tropius! Wait, what's special? Oh god, you have a ancient full team power. of six. Holy crap. Oh. Is it ancient power? Yeah. yeah. It is true. Isn't it always special? Yep. Well, since... Yeah. Since this game. Since this game, yeah. Wow, El Capone, you caught up to my other team people so fast. Special attack Boosted rooms. experience really helps. Can't wait and for my frost last. So freaking that I can miss for once. I have all the double teams. It's like you're a real freaking trainer using protect on your Yanma to get a free speed boost. What? Yeah. Dude, your whole oh. team is weak to flying. You need to think about changing something, dude. Alright, I'll probably... Yeah, I'm gonna have a frost last eventually, so I'm just gonna use that. Magical leaf! You have been murderated! See, the funny thing about my joke that I just made is that it's totally true. I have nothing that resists flying. Really? Yeah. <clears throat> Like, this whole team here I'm fighting has been bug, grass, or fighting type. Okay. My Murkrow is just destroying them. Oh, I kind of want to fight that guy. Did you skip trainers on your way to the town? I don't think I did. <clears throat> oh, darn. My Apom can't escape from this mischievous. Now I can only just keep trying to astonish it. Astonish you. Let's not do 50 turns of setup and just go for a magical leap immediately. <coughs> That's not Cynthia. Totally looked like her. The hair did. Yeah. I only saw the top of the head. I didn't like see a face or anything. So silly. Oh look, more things that are weak to the flying. You guys are making it too. Stop protecting. Making it too easy. Wait a minute. Wait. There's a delaying the inevitable. The inevitable. The inedible. Yeah. I mean, Is that gonna be the? We're uh... dumb. It's kind of gross. Do I have? I don't. When does uh, Kranidos evolve? 40. Darn, he's got 10 more levels, 11 more levels to go. Knocking around up. 17 more levels. 80. So let me guess, your thing is you have all three Wormadoms. <coughs> <coughs> How did he know? Because he saw the second Wormadom and figured the third one wasn't far behind. <laughs> and what do you know? Here it is. That's my other name. Uh... I like the battle music in this game. So, what a geek. What are your hopes for E3? <coughs> Hopelessness. New Pokemon spinoff for the Switch. What if it's like a main series game on the Switch, like rumored? Eh. I don't think they'd you do wouldn't. that, honestly. I think they just want to give it to the DS and 3DS. Technically and a handheld, still. Yeah, but eh, I don't see it happening. Okay. Um, what other series do I enjoy? I want Jet Set Radio Future HD at some point. Not Sega necessarily. Sega doesn't really give it much attention. Yeah, not necessarily for the Switch, but just in general. Petition. 
Okay. Uh. What else? Smash for Switch, I think, is inevitable. Well, I mean, Reggie kind of dropped a hint on that. Like, we know you want it. It's coming. We just can't say when. Smish. But the Thanks question for the contribution, is, X-Zero. Will it be a port or, be or a new game? It'll be a port. Because <laughs> if you remember, before the Wii U 3DS one even came out, Bandai Namco was uh, hiring for another Smash game. So what if they were working on both at once? I doubt that. Sakurai said that he would be done with Smash after Wii U. Yeah, but that so doesn't if they mean ported, the team that, that means they can still have another Smash game come out without oh, it being right. a new Smash. Yeah, but he, the same team who did the Wii U one could have done the new one without Sakurai. Wasn't this around the time that the 3DS version just came out, so the one after that would be the Wii U? Well, no, this was like for a whole nother game. It was like Smash oh. 6 or 5 or something. I don't know. Depending on if they count 3DS and Wii U as two different ones. Has there ever been like a sequel to a game series that was that didn't include the uh, original creator that turned out to be better than the others. There have been a few cases, but although I can't really remember any off the top of my head. Okay, because I was just thinking of all the ones that, that didn't turn out alright with. Mega Man X6. Anything that Miyamoto had its hand, had its yeah. hand in. Oh my god, you should never be the judge for clothing, though. Nah. He does not know how to pick good clothing designs. Oh. So let's talk about Paper Mario Sticker <laughs> Star. Oh my lord. <clears throat> I'd rather not. So, before the game became what it is, it looked like just another entry into the Paper Mario series, where you had a partner, you had the same stage battle system. Yeah. Uh, you had a lot of the same things that made a Paper Mario game Paper Mario, it seemed like. And then, and then Miyamoto, Miyamoto stepped in, said don't do this, and made it different. And made it bad. Um, he doesn't... He said he doesn't like them creating new characters. He wants them to stick with the basics. That bugs the hell out of me, too, because Which is why Paper Mario went for three games length of doing just that, and that's what they that's what made them different. That's what made them enjoyable. It made right. them so much better. Like that's It showed the, you like a town of toads, and they're not that's all identical. That's the whole identical. point of and Paper Mario is that it's a it's a Mario world in which you can do whatever you want with like that because it won't affect the main series of right. Mario games. Right, it's a spin-off, not a main right. series and, entry. Right, and then you know, Miyamoto's all like, you know what, these are my characters, I don't want you making up stuff, use what I have. What if somebody else owned the rights to just the Paper Mario character? I mean, that could Technically, be like Square Enix did. and RPG. Yeah. RPG. There was a different company that work on the publishing of <coughs> the first few games than yeah. Nintendo. Nintendo was just the, like, property owner. To, to be, be continued. continued. If you enjoyed this video, then you might enjoy some of our other videos. There's a playthrough of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Blue Rescue Team, where the player character is a Psyduck. But if you're itching for more action, our Monster Hunter 3 series will scratch that itch. If either of those sound interesting to you, the links to their playlists are on screen right now. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next episode for more Gen 4.